All right, we're talking about a big show, big show big tomorrow show. night at the Valar Center located under the Black Family Ice Rink right in the heart of Beaver Creek. I've got Ruthie here. She is with the Valar Center. And uh, Ruthie, thanks for coming in. Nice yeah, to see you. Yeah, I'm excited. You are excited? It's going to be a big show. Let's fire everybody up. Who's coming yeah. tomorrow night? Tomorrow night we have three artists, and it's a collaboration performance, so they're all performing together, and they actually just released an album together. And it is Nico Case, Katie Lang, and Laura Veers. And Nico Case, I'm not sure if you're familiar with her. I'm familiar with all of them, but let's yeah. let everybody know because maybe okay. there's some people aren't. She's like a real rocker. Like, she is so, so hip. Um, she was on the New Pornographers, which is where she really got her start okay. as an artist. You might know her from that band. Um, Katie Lang, you know, she has that beautiful voice. She sang for the Olympics. I don't yeah. know if you remember seeing oh, yeah, that I know, for I Vancouver. Do. I like, got goosebumps right now yeah, just thinking about it. Right, sure. right? Yeah, right? Yeah. Um, and then Laura Veers, and she's a Colorado native uh, and a folk singer. She does some kids' songs. She also has a solo album release. So the three of them put together this, like, super How did these three, star. do you know how these three kind of got together? Do you have any idea how it all started? Yeah, for them? they sort of released a story, and Katie Lang, I guess, had, was just fans of Nico Case and Laura Veers, and she sent an, an email and said, let's put out an album, and here they are. Now they're on tour. Now they're on tour. Yeah. So is this part of the first start of their tour? They've been on tour for a while? Um, yes, this is the first start of their tour. I think they've been on for two weeks. Okay. or so and I know they're also in Denver but that show is sold out so okay oh, um, no we kidding. still have tickets available so if you are coming up to the mountains this weekend there's still a chance you could see it and honestly for the Valar Center a show like this in the Valar Center because yeah. of that intimate environment there's not gonna be a bad seat in that place and honestly they're gonna right. blow that place up it's gonna be so good yeah it's just it's gonna be beautiful music um, but then they're also gonna rock out so it'll be a lot oh, yeah. of fun oh, and yeah. it'll just be a great crowd and we have two tickets we're gonna be giving away yeah during the right. show today, so we want to let everybody know that. So don't call right now, but we have a little trivia for you at some point. And those tickets are $102 mm -hmm. a piece, so that's a $204 value. Yeah, good math. Not bad, huh? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Not bad. So um, there's a good chance, though, that, that the show might fill up pretty yeah. quickly, so I recommend if you want to go, people probably should get tickets early. Yeah, yeah, do, do it early, um, but also, you know, you can stop by our ticket office, go online, give us a call. Okay. So. And then also we have some more great shows in the yeah. lineup. So next week, yeah, Robert Cray. I love Robert Cray too. Uh, do you? Yeah, I do. Okay. Yeah. Um, well, he's an amazing guitarist. He's played with Eric Clapton. He's played with Keith Richards. So this guy knows his stuff. And uh, yeah, I don't know if do you like blues because we got a couple blues. I like artists. blues. You got Boss first. Gags coming too, right behind yeah. Robert. Cray. I know. I was gonna say he's the first of a couple really incredible blues artists. Um, but yeah, his show is definitely selling quick. So get those also this week when you're getting your Kitty Lang tickets. This just shows you the diversity of the artists that come to Valar Center. We see musicians and jugglers and performances of all sorts and types, mm -hmm. but the music is always top notch there all oh, the time thanks. year round. Yeah, we like to think so. What's the best? What's your website if people want to find out more information of upcoming shows or to buy tickets? It's valarpac.org. Okay, and then um, your location, obviously, let's let mm -hmm. people know once again sure. for parking and things like that if they want to come up there and, and yeah. be part of the show tomorrow night. Yeah, so it's free parking in Beaver Creek in the summer, so you can park at either structure in the village. Um, we also do have some really incredible restaurant show night specials, so if you go to our website, you can see like there's a bunch of different restaurants in Beaver Creek Village that are doing um, specials if you want to go out before the show. Oh, great. Yeah, so then you can park, so, and um, like I said, parking's free, and the theater is located right below the ice rink in the village. Um, yep. So it's easy access, regardless of where you're coming from. And you know, Beaver Creek is a small area too. It's yeah. not like you're going to get lost up no. there. It's nice and convenient and easy. Right. We went to a show last year, and we went and had dinner first, and we said mm -hmm. we were going to a show, and they kind of just made everything happen a little bit faster. So there's no alarm there. If you're going to go and have dinner first, uh, the restaurants that are a part of that program will get you in and out, so you can make it to the show in right. time to get a good seat. Right. And we do also have a lobby bar. So if you're not into, you know, going out. For dinner, you can just stop by and grab a drink on your way into the theater. Thanks, Ruthie. Yeah, thanks so much. So Can't nice wait. to see you. It's yeah. going to be a great show. So tomorrow night over at the Valar Center, underneath the Black Family Ice Rink, we have uh, Katie Lang. I'm going to get this right, though. Katie Lang, Laura Veers, and Nico Case taking to the stage at the Valar Center. Tickets are still available, but we do have two to give away during the show, so stay tuned for that. We'll be right back with more Good Morning Vale. Ashley's going to be giving you weather in a little bit. Leo's also going to be giving you some weather reports from Beaver Creek. We'll be right back.